Um, hi, uh, so right now we're at the Green Hub and we're with the co-convener of the Young Greens party and we're going to do a little interview. I'm really excited to meet as many Greens as possible and people across the environmental movement. Um, so we're going to be going to the demonstrations, both the climate strike on Friday um, and then the big demo and um, the Global Day of Action on Saturday as well. So really looking forward to kind of meeting people from like right across the green movement, people with quite a range of perspectives. Um, and yeah, I think it's going to be really good. I mean, obviously, there's kind of only so much that we can do from outside of COP. Um, but it's really good to kind of for ourselves as a movement to connect with each other and also to kind of do what we can to build public pressure um, from outside of the talks. And for Greens, like what are like your main ambitions kind of for COP? Like what is what would be the most effective outcome at the end of this. Hoping to build public pressure on those who are in the talks taking part in the COP um, and really kind of um, build that sense of urgency that we need action now that there are kind of you know there isn't time to wait to do a, a kind of a bit around the edges we kind of have to do everything all at once and um, however difficult that might be so yeah definitely communicating that sense of urgency is really important and yeah that there there really is no time to waste here we've been talking for quite a long time about how we don't have time <laughs> and it's almost frustrating how long we've been communicating that message so yeah I, I really I hope that this is the time that we do start to see some change at COP and was it um on Friday that you said that other um members of like Young Greens party will be coming here yeah, um, and so how do you anticipate that to go? Yeah, I think we're kind of hoping to engage with different parts of the Young Greens. So like there's like university groups and things um, and then like even younger Greens as well that are at school um, and kind of the school strikers as well. So yeah, it should be kind of able to bring together quite a lot of different people. I mean, we have a lot of our members that are quite engaged from like different university groups, but um, it can definitely be harder to engage with like younger members and people who really will kind of be feeling the brunt of um of climate change so really really important to be engaging with younger people as well